Yes, hello everyone, this is your guy Davin the Geek. And today, this is a different video um, from what I would usually do. And I I suggest, or I don't suggest, but um, I thought about doing it because I'm sure some people didn't don't know about doing this when they open their computer or um, they forget about it. And it is applying thermal compound to your CPU and your graphics chip if you have one or anything. So yeah, um, after you clean your computer out, your laptop, yeah, and desktop, you will take this the fan off the CPU, just like that. And when you do that, you you tend to mess up the thermal compound, or it will dry out really fast, and you don't want that. That's why uh, most computers will overheat. So yeah, make sure it doesn't over um, over your computer isn't overheating, and make sure your thermal compound is you know dried up. So I suggest for you to do is go out and buy yourself some thermal compound. Something just like this. I bought mine from Radio Shack for about $6. This is, I don't know if you can see that if it's focusing right, but it, it probably would show inside the video. Um, hold on, let me see something. Yeah, can you see that? Oh well. But it's the premium kind. But yeah, you're going to apply this straight to your CPU and motherboard. I mean, in this right here, and it's going to keep your your um, system as cool if you um, apply it correctly. So let me open this right here. So yeah, um, you know, you might be wondering, what is thermal compound? Well, it's the it's a type of gel that goes onto your CPU because CPUs are different. Most CPUs can be all metal up here, you know, all metal. But for my laptop, it only it's only a small little bit right there that you want to put on it. But um, again, some might be huge and really big, so you got to look out for that. This one is for laptops. So I hope this is, um, I hope it's already open, or I don't have to open it myself. Let me push it up a little. Okay, yeah, it's already open. So... Let me zoom this camera in just a bit. Alright, what you're going to want to do is apply it very lightly. You don't want to put a, a lot on on it. I'm getting my light over here so you can see. Oops, drop the thermal compound. And make sure you're grounded and um, you know don't have static on you before you open up your computer. You know, wear a static wristband or something. Okay, you're going to want to put Come on, get off. Hope this isn't too much cuz it's starting to squirt out a bit. Yeah. Okay. Again, you do not want to waste this stuff. You know, um, put it on yourself or waste it. Okay, I hope you can see that. I have that right there. So let me smooth this up. Oh, let me use something else.
Okay, now that that is done, um, you just put your fan back on and put your screws back onto your laptop and close it up. Uh, this type of compound right here, hold on, this compound right here, it was rather sticky. And it was sticking to the cardboard, so I had to apply a little dab more a few times, probably like two times, to get that thermal compound on there. So it was getting a bit sticky there, so yeah. Um, I probably fa had, probably will do a fast forward through that. So yeah, you apply it, you know, do a light touchly. Do, I mean, ha, what is that? <laughs> what is a light touchly? <laughs> so, uh, like I meant to say, is touch lightly on the goop if you get this kind. Don't press hard or you're just going to get it stuck to the paper or whatever you're using. Hold on. Uh, if you're using this kind, make sure to tap lightly so you can smooth it. So this has been your guy Davin the Geek. I hope this has been helpful. If you have any questions, please contact me through a PM or comments down below. See you all later. Please subscribe. And Davin the Geek out. Peace.